Hey guys, welcome to another video of CodeCon. Today I'll be uh, solving another interview question that is asked uh, in Amazon for the data engineer position. So uh, we are given with a merchant table, these are table and for uh, in this particular table we are uh, given uh, the amount the merchant receives and the payment mode. Uh, so we need to uh, output uh, this type of table where um, uh, for each merchant uh, the transaction mode is mentioned and the total amount he received for that particular transaction mode is also given so for merchant one he receives 200 by cash and similarly he receives uh, 300 by cash so it sums up to be 500 uh, uh, so it is displayed here and for merchant one he receives uh, 700 online so it is uh, shown only 700 similarly for merchant two he receives uh, 520 rupees online uh, it's shown here and uh, merchant 2 receives 50 rupees in cash so it's shown here for merchant 3 he receives no money in cash as you can see he receives only 1400 via online so it's show here shown here and uh, uh, the cash amount is zero so for this particular uh, solution I, I will use two uh, techniques uh, two concepts actually uh, one is a, a aggregate function that's the sum function along with the case uh, function right so select from merchant merchant and uh, first merchant ID should be displayed uh, merchant ID sum the case condition case when uh, payment mode is equal to uh, case when the payment mode is equal to cash then we will uh, sum up to then uh, we will sum the amount uh, else add zero we're going to end this as cash cash underscore mode right so uh, similarly i will do this for the online mode so i just copy it paste it online and online mode online mode so what happens is that and after as you have used the uh, some functions which is an aggregate function so I need to include a group by clause I will group this by the merchant ID by the merchant ID right so what happens once run uh, let's run it once so yeah okay uh, then amount is zero uh, case when payment Achha, online it's wrong online yeah let's run it again yeah it's showing the right output now okay uh, so for uh, merchant id one uh, the cash transaction is uh, sums up to be 500 and the online transactions sums out to be 700 right so uh, what happens is that uh, we are uh, using the aggregate function and within the aggregate function we are using the uh, case statement right the it's a kind of if else statement so the case statement says that when the online uh, when the payment mode is cash then we uh, then we are uh, adding that amount else we are adding zero so where, wherever uh, the payment mode is cash it's adding uh, the amount and uh, it's displaying as a cash mode amount right and wherever the payment mode is online it's adding that particular amount and it's displaying as a online mode amount so as we have used the uh, uh, aggregate statement we are using the group by statement as well where uh, we are grouping each Mm, uh, mode of transaction for the uh, merchant ID right for each merchant ID we are showing the aggregated values I hope this solution is clear to you guys I will be bringing more such uh, problem statements and solutions so keep watching thank you